are the pros and cons of this property? Number one, this property has big character. If you look at the exterior, it looks like no building that you'd see outside of Quebec City. We have a beautiful rooftop patio that has a fantastic view of the St. Lawrence River, and then we have the opportunity to actually make that larger. The second part of the thing that we love about this property is we do have the ability to add units, which of course would increase the revenue above and beyond what we've under. The third thing that we love is we have the ability to automate the check-in. And as I previously described, that's something that adds a huge amount of value because we're decreasing our operating expenses and using technology that exists today to improve the operation. Now, there are actually a few things that we don't like about this property, and you should be aware of before you start investing. Number one, we bought this property as a share purchase, which means instead of buying the asset and transferring the title of ownership out to a new company, we were actually required to buy the shares of a company that owned the real estate, and we transferred the shares out of that company to our company. What this means is it increased our accounting and legal due diligence costs because we had to make sure that there weren't any undisclosed lawsuits or tax burdens that we didn't know of. So our legal and accounting costs were much higher than a traditional uh, asset purchase. Additionally, we are inheriting the balance sheet from the vendor, which means they've depreciated the value of the asset over many, many years. And we will be required if we ever sell this asset to pay capital gains from their depreciated value up until the, the price that we sell it for. The second thing we don't like about this property is that it failed the phase one and phase two environmental report, meaning that there's site contamination that we have since cleaned up. And for you as an ADDI member, you no longer have to worry about this, but there was an incurred cost to decontaminate the property. And the final thing that we don't like about this property is that it's actually located outside of the ramparts of Quebec City, which is a border that goes around the old port and is considered to be old Quebec and the hottest tourist destination. Now, we're not too far outside of there. We're still walking distance, but it would have been preferred if it was located within the walls. But we've done our research in the market and we decided that it makes great revenue, there's great upside, and it's not that far away, so we decided to buy it anyway.